Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today I'll <coughs> it's gonna freaking match today and today I'll be doing a top ten video of my top ten favourite Doctor Who monsters. So number ten let's get straight to it. Number ten is the flag. They are actually my my like top well uh Let's remove the right. So number 10 is the peg dogs. They are very creepy now. They um they can like grab your head and if they grab your hand or head, you change into one of them. Now they are very creepy and I don't want to be showing you them as a, my figure. I've got a figure of them because they could scare the audience. So yeah. Number 9, the master. He, yeah, he's good. He's a villain, and I just don't think he could go like in the top five because he's not in many episodes, and I just I think he's a bit naff, but I do think he's pretty creepy. And if you if I saw him in ta attacking Earth, I don't think I'd ever. I don't think I'd live. I'd just hide away and die probably. But anyway, going to number eight. The, oh, what's they called again? Clockwork droids. Oh, they scared me as a child. They get out from under your bed and then they cut you open with this little, like, slicer. And it's disgusting because they kill a little, they tried to kill a little Spanish girl. That was an actually bit. Bye. My boy, But anyway, going straight to number six, The Flood, finally. They are very creepy, really creepy. They are actually my childhood scares. And he's a David Tennant one, because I really like the David Tennant one. He's my favourite doctor with Christopher Eccleston. I'm being about it. I hate Matt Smith. And anyway, yeah. Um, um, I was going to say. By the day, that's what I was going to say. I'm joking. And basically, the flood can they if one drop of their infected water from Mars will turn you into one of them, which is really weird and creepy. So that is why they're on my list. And I haven't got any pictures of them because they they're my childhood scare and they still scare me now. So I ain't showing you nothing of them. Not being But anyway, we're going straight to number five in the top five now. So straight to number five, we have. The Cybermen. They are a classic Doctor Who monster. They are very good and scary. Don't give me too much, but they are very good and scary. They're classic. They've been in first, second, fourth, fifth, third, sixth, seventh, ninth, no, seventh, tenth, eleventh, and twelfth. So most of the doctors actually just missing out. Three doctors. So thirteen take away three is ten. So ten doctors who met him. But anyway. So yeah, straight to number four. We have the Daleks. The, I know they're classic and they should be in number four. Or three or two and one, but I do think they're not very scary. They are very good and very scary, but not that scary. So I don't really have much to say about them. They exterminate you and everything. You can get pictures of them up if you're looking for them now. I'll try and get a picture description in the description below, and hopefully you think that's good too. So number three. Um. Oh, what was that again? Oh, the silence. They are very creepy. They their hands are like, but no. They have two fingers and they go. No, yeah, they have two fingers and they go with their hands and go. And it sends out a massive blast to kill you. But once you look away from them, once you like turn your back, or you look down and you don't see them, you forget them. Look back up, you remember them. Forget. Remember, forget, remember, it's very weird. And, um, 
Balde. Anyway, so number two, we are going straight to. Oh, I can't remember what she's called. She's like a ghost girl, and she's like blue, but she get one drop of blood from her. She smells it and comes and kills you, so it's very weird. So, right to number one. Number one. Hang on. First, a few honourable honourable mentions. The Drashics. The Mutants. The Dalek Emperor. And number one, Davros. Davros is flipping scary. He creeps people out. He is gross. He opens up his stomach, shows you his heart, his ribcage, everything. Oh, he's scary. He has no eyes. They're like this. He's only just recently got eyes. And he has like a little blue eye in there. And he, he goes like that with his metal hand claws. Yeah, because it's from metal cause and sends out electric from both of them. He goes, Brr! but he only has one hand, so he goes in his little seat, Brr! and clicks all the buttons. So that is why it's very scary, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video, my top 10 doc scariest Doctor Who monsters, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Subscribe. Merry Christmas.